For today, I would like to show you guys how to get the new fancy NVIDIA Shield TV remote. This one right here, new nice one, which I can't wait to use, to uh, work with the original Shield TV from at least 2018 and older. Um, also, thank you for watching my video and subscribing. And uh, if you're not a subscriber and you do like my videos and you want to see more, you know, please feel feel free to subscribe for more coming. All right. So first things first, guys, we need to go ahead and do the upgrade. So the first thing you'll need to do is have this upgrade. If it should pop up on your TV. By the way, I'm using this remote, the original one, which is it's a great remote and all. And I like how you can change the batteries out on it now, but uh, it has its limitations, just like some of the other controllers they used to have. So anyway, <clears throat> so yeah, you need to first install the Shield Experience Upgrade 8.0.2. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. And it looks like I've already done it. Um, let's go ahead and see what's new with it. This upgrade is for the remote. And that way it'll bring the remote everything to you. You see what it says, new features included motion activated backlight buttons, which is nice, remote lo locator feature, which I always lost this thing everywhere because it's so small and thin, and customized menu button, which I haven't done yet. So available purchase, which you can get. And I got mine from someone that bought a couple of these, I guess, and uh, didn't need all the remotes. So I got it for 15 bucks of all things. But anyway, my score, they're lost. Um, some new stuff, stream new movies and TV shows on Plex, meaning if you have a Plex, you're a Plex subscriber and you pay for the Plex services, they have free movies and TV shows that you can watch with, uh, commercials and it's just fewer commercials, whatever. BET Plus is now in shape. That's cool. And some new games, which I generally don't do. Um, other things, access, DVR, all that fun stuff for NAS. All right, let's restart and install real quick. And this is all real time. Um, if it does get too long to, you know, closer to 10 minutes or so, I'll pause it because I don't want to go longer than 10 minutes on a video for you guys. So you don't have to sit here forever watching things. It's going pretty fast so far. The kind of thing I do like actually, if you look, there's a Netflix button right there. So you can Netflix and chill with just the remote by point and the button. Pretty sweet. Volume control up and down. Of course that forward reverse. Oh, on that, that's nice instead of the old one where there wasn't really forward. So you kind of had to hit the, the sides here and there to make it work. Um, what else you got? Volume up, volume down, power. And then the, so, which I'll find out, of course the double circle button for home, but there's a menu button now. This doesn't have the menu button. So this should be pretty sweet. And from what I understood there was a, uh, Double A or triple A in this versus the watch batteries in this one, which I mean, I love this remote and it lasts a very long time. Um, I do like the way it looks better, but they're, you know, and uh, they are kind of both slippery. Like this remote's pretty slippery. I'm going to have to put some sign of grip or something, some sort of um, case piece and cut a, cut some of the case piece and put it in the back of this so I can actually hold it so it doesn't slip out of my hands all the time. Cause that's a big the problem with this one. It always drops and always lose it. Yeah, let me go ahead and I'm going to pause this real quick because this is taking a little bit longer. So it's a it's a decent size setup and I'll return right as it's done. 
Yeah, so this is taking a pretty long time. It's only just about three quarters through. I know you can't see very well because the um, the camera decides to not focus on the black and on the white with the black screen for some weird reason, but it's just about to the E right now. I'll pause real quick and come right back. It's finally getting there, restarting. Yeah, it took a while and I'm over Wi-Fi, but still I have super fast speed, so it's, it must be a pretty big update. Sorry about the focus issue. I'm recording this on the Google Pixel 4 XL. And it's the first time doing it. I'm just checking it out and see how well it does in video recording. Boot menu is definitely taking longer. It's taking a little bit to do it. We're already at 42 seconds or so after installing it and starting back up and restarting. What's new with it? Yep, yeah, we know that. Cool. I'll back out of that. Or oh, this might be part of it. Sorry about that. Yeah, it's not letting me. Okay. Let's try something real quick. I think it's still updating because it's doing, um, I'm trying to use this right now and it's not doing anything. Great. There we go, back button, finally. Jeez. Settings. Now we'll go with settings once it's installed. Go to devices, remotes, and accessories. Shield accessories. And what you do is you hold this down on the new one. And that was quick. Oh, yeah. Sweet. Yeah. So I'm using this one right now. Sweet. That was really quick. It looks like there's new updates for it, too. So let's just back out of here. Now, all righty, good. All right, um, yeah. I'm not gonna deal with this right now, I'll do it later. Cause we already got this one installed. Let's get out of here, press home. Get down here, perfect. All right, so I'm gonna try the Netflix button, see if it actually works. Netflix. Holy smackerel. Oh, you know what must we don't want that play for a while. Perfect. And you see it's backlit and everything. I don't think yeah, I don't have the volume set to go through the shield, so that's not gonna work for that. And let's try one more thing. Power powered off. Boom. Power back on. And boom. Nice. Whether you guys have it, very simple. As long as you get that update, install the update, wait a little bit, connect the remote by pressing and holding the button right here, you should be good to go. So I'm Naked Ninja. Thanks for watching the video. Hope you like it. If you liked it, give me a thumbs up. If you want to see more and you're not a subscriber, please subscribe. Other than that, you guys have a great day and have a great year. Bye.